shit. Lots of shit. The SU. You furry crap factory. And shit for another reason. Um, I have to be very careful where I stand. Um, what I tend to do is I wait for a, a lovely cold frosty morning, much like today, um, to come out and harvest the stuff. <laughs> uh, it makes it so much easier to... Anyway, as I was saying, shit for another reason. Well, I, no, no. Because this is something I've actually been expecting for a long time. Um, technically it's happened before, but not to the extent um, that it happened on this occasion. I woke up in the morning, switched the computer on, looked at my emails, and there was an email from YouTube um, stating that someone had made a copyright claim on the content of one of my videos. Now, as I say, this has happened a couple of times before, and has usually resulted in uh, adverts advertisements being placed on the actual video, which is fine. If YouTube wants to, they can do that on every single one of my videos. Because almost every single one of my videos contains copyrighted music. And that's also one of the reasons why I haven't bothered becoming a partner. Because if they saw my videos, it would be adios amigos. Oh, and by the way, if that ever does happen, and Brad Thunder suddenly disappears off the face of the earth, look out for Brad's Thunder. <laughs> which is how I'll come back. Anyway, I get this email saying that uh, in this particular instance the uh, owner had made a copyright claim and the result was the video being pulled from YouTube. Now, it was an old video, um, if any of you remember. Um, going way back, it was the St Andrews drive around video where uh, I stuck the camera on the bonnet of the Land Rover and drove around the town and uh, to the accompaniment of several tracks of music. Um, one being The Cure's Friday I'm In Love, uh, which is how they actually caught me. Um, now the thing is, I wasn't actually all that happy with that video, to be honest. Um, it's, it was an old video, um, and at the time uh, when I decided to make it, it was a day much like today. What is he on? What is it? You can't go... That's somebody else's garden, Max. Come here. Come on. Yes, you. Uh, yeah, it was a day like this, and I went to St Andrews, took Buddy for a walk on the beach, and by the time it came to actually make the video, it was pouring the rain. And the camera that I have, the Samsung camera, this is Annie's camera, this is a Canon camera, which is a far superior machine, um, isn't very good at telling the difference between the sky and the ground, so it tends to get a bit dark or too bright or, or whatever. Um, so anyway, uh, I wasn't terribly happy with the results of that video and it doesn't matter because it's no longer on the air. Although YouTube do give you the option of... Um... Sorry, Max had just gotten in the neighbour's garden and I just stood in one of his fresh ones. Uh, so yeah, as I say, the, the video was pulled and it's no big deal. Um, but what... I'm not going to say pisses me off. Because it's, you know, it's fair dues, I was using copyrighted material, which we're not supposed to do, and I accept that 100%. Uh, you know, <sighs> sorry, he'd jumped the fence again. Yeah, so I wouldn't really say I was bothered as such. Um, puzzled would be more an accurate description. Vexed. I'm terribly vexed. Um, because what I did, as soon as I found out the reason why it had been pulled, which was the use of the Cures Friday I Am In Love. Now this was at a time when I used to, um, being a good little boy, give credit to the artists whose music I used by listing it in the info section. Now, YouTube now being owned by Google, this all-powerful, all-seeing search engine, is obviously able to pick up on things. Because you'll notice on people's videos, when adverts do appear, they are relevant to the title. Um, so they obviously have this facility to, to do that. Um, but yeah, one of the first things I did when I saw it was the Cures, Friday I'm in Love, was that I went to the search bar, typed in Cure and Friday and hit enter. And up comes all these music videos, actual music videos of the Cure singing Friday I'm in Love. All live 
all, some of them with, I think one of them has about 3 million views. My video had had a couple of thousand because again those were the days when I used to do relevant tags uh, to try and attract attention to the videos. Now I just use Brad Thunder you know, for the subscribers. Um, so yeah, they've gone to all this trouble to find this embedded music track on a vlogger's video with a few thousand views, which is really good. I mean, I'm quite chuffed it had a few thousand. Um, and yet all these other ones which can be found with almost no effort whatsoever and are a much more blatant um, infringement of copyright and yet they're all still live now that I'm not really able to kind of grasp the now that I don't really understand <sighs> anyway hope you all have a nice day I'm going away to shovel shit. <laughs> <laughs>